In large Indian cities, auto rickshaws constitute 20% of motorized trips made, but only 2% of traffic. Despite this, the sector is characterized by a number of problems on the driver and customer side. The rickshaws are so important that they're safe. They are actually an innovation that India should be proud of and not ashamed of. The Rickshaw Rising Challenge was launched to support entrepreneurs that are addressing these questions with $100,000 in funding and up to six months of mentoring support. You know, as a transportation engineer who grew up in Bombay and used rickshaws a lot, I always believed that, you know, rickshaws had a role in sustainable transport. It's a part of the system that is really important, but it's also a part of the system that maybe isn't functioning as well as it could. And and really need some innovation and some change. Our research in the auto rickshaw sector showed us systemic issues across the entire ecosystem. When we released our report, we realized there was a lot of young entrepreneurs also realizing that rickshaws have an important role to play and starting up really creative businesses. As Shell Foundation, we've joined in partnership with Embark um, to run this Rickshaw Rising Challenge. We received 46 applications from over 13 cities in India. We shortlisted eight companies, uh, and out of the eight, we had three winners. So, so there are 12 tier ones, 34 tier two, and 54 tier three markets of the top 100 cities of India. Right, the cabs are present mainly in the tier ones, and they're not present uh, in tier two or tier three. But auto rickshaws are, and that's where we see an opportunity for company li like ours. When we launched in April 2030, there was no standardization of auto rickshaw fares. So the idea of rickshaw rising is to create in three or four years to create fleet rickshaw operators that own that run 20,000, 25,000 rickshaws, so that we are able to provide a substantially higher quality service to all the people in our cities. Uh, for us, the rickshaw rising challenge happened at the right moment. Last year when we wanted to do a pilot with respect to uh, trying out our book -a ride service, we needed some risk risk capital. And that is exactly when we, we, we uh, won this rickshaw rising challenge and access to that fund helped us pilot the book -a ride service. We realized that instant hailing or e-hailing is what the customers really wanted, whereas what we were providing was you know, booking or advanced booking. So that also helped us align ourselves uh, in the right direction. But the expert guidance helped the company grow six times over a period of eight months. We've delivered uh, more than half a million rides uh, with, uh, with over 100,000 customers. Uh, today we engage 700 plus out of the 2,000 registered auto riders. Through a partnership with Taxi for sure, we have uh, given the solution to 500 plus drivers. Our partnership with Canada Bank at a national level allows us to get our driver loans processed at a very fast rate. We've been able to help the drivers earn uh, over, you know, uh, north of 35,000 and 45,000 from Auto Valley platform each month. We have given close to about 700 plus loans already and we have another, about another 500 plus in the process. And now the drivers are able to become owners in just about three years with the same existing cash outflow that they that they already have. So, I have to say that I have to उससे मेरा को मेरा खुद का गाड़ी हो गया मेरा तो नया गाड़ी भी मिल गया बहुत अच्छा लग रहा है मेरे At Embark India we're working to identify transformative ideas that can bring uh, impact at scale to cities uh, and we're working to transform these markets and catalyze them the way we have with the auto rickshaw segment over the last two years